One of the most controversial immigration policies is about to come to an end. Reporter Krista Lucas went to Tijuana to investigate and brought back this story. The Biden administration is reversing a Trump-era policy introduced during the pandemic. The policy used COVID to prevent hundreds of thousands of migrants from crossing the border, even those who were running for their lives. Tijuana is a fun place to visit, unless you are an asylum seeker running away from violence. I fear the worst, which is that they can kidnap my family, they can kidnap me. We will call him Miguel. We cannot show his face because traffickers in Guatemala have threatened to kill the former drug enforcement officer. They started calling me on my phone saying that they were going to kill me, that they were going to kidnap me, that they knew where I lived. Miguel and his family ran away seeking asylum at the U.S.-Mexico border. This barrier behind me between San Diego and Tijuana is one of the obstacles for people who are running away from violence. Immigration advocates say there are legal procedures that place asylum seekers in harm's way. If someone crosses, they might be expelled back to Mexico or their home country under Title 42. It's a violation of human rights. It's a violation of U.S. asylum law, of international law. Title 42 is a 1940s health statute. The Trump administration used it during COVID to prevent migrants from seeking asylum. The, the U.S. has helped lots of asylum seekers. At the same time, the U.S., you know, the, the implementation of our asylum laws um, have been discriminatory. According to the U.S. Customs and Border Protection, Title 42 was used to expel more than one million migrants last year. I feel like they can figure out where I am. It's not our country. I mean, we don't know where to run, where to hide. For now, life for Miguel and his family means hiding a breath away from safety. The Biden administration plans to end this policy on May 23rd. Republicans and even some Democrats are concerned this change in policy will invite a flood of migrants trying to cross the border. Back to you in the studio.